Why are you here, third? Uh, okay, I'm not gonna read the dialogue because I really just don't give a shit. It's all, <sighs> it's all meaningly meaningless. Okay, can I like pick up a job? Are you just gonna talk forever? Thank you. Okay, first thing, coconut. Yes, this is probably as good as it's gonna get for now. I'm gonna try and show off every job. I'm not gonna promise that I'm gonna be able to do everything perfectly. But, like, you get a variety of different jobs. I should show them off. I'm gonna try and show them off at least once. Um, each one. When it comes to grinding and stuff, I'm just gonna do that off the... off screen. Yes, find the place marked on the map. Where the... F fuck? Okay, here it is. And I got that pretty pink M. This one's not too bad, though. Oh, shut up. Okay. You know, I'm just gonna say it just because, like, I had to be reminded. If you want to get off the bike, you gotta push down the control pad, which is a bit weird. But, eh. Just in case you were, like, confused. Which, I don't know how you would be, because... If you have the game, you should know how to play it. In any case, you knock the hell out of trees, and then you get hit with coconuts. I'm gonna try and get a little bit more first. Yeah, okay, Travis, you get hurt. That's fucking great. And here's the annoying part. You pick this up, right? And then you gotta tap A to walk. And then you grab more. And the more you grab, not only the more you get, but the slower you go. I don't know how heavy one of these coconuts would be, but I'd just like to imagine that it's not heavy enough that you have to waddle like a fucking penguin. You get three minutes. Yeah, there you go. And then you rinse and repeat. I'm just gonna go ahead and show this for, you know, the hell of it. Because something about a guy, like, you know, fucking punching the shit out of a tree is kind of funny to me. If I were you, I'd try and go for at least two before delivering it. Like, don't go one at a time. The more you have, the better. Try and remember which trees you hit. And if you can, get at least two to three. Two at the very least. Three would be pushing it, but, you know, pay attention to how time is and all that. You! Like, have I. Has there been a point where I haven't been hit with a coconut? Like, that's an honest question. Because I think I've been hit by. A, okay. A coconut each and every time. See? It's like it's a trend. It's like, hey, Travis in the head Friday. It's actually Sunday. For me, I mean. <laughs> oh, -ho. Pick it up. I was out of my way to get it, but whatever, who cares. I don't know, this game's not too bad. I mean, this minigame, I can deal with it. Usually I end up getting at least ten, so that's... I don't remember, I didn't pay attention to how much it was, but you get paid at least maybe twenty or something. It's, it's not bad, it's probably a bigger number. Because 150 LBs, let's see. Hey, you're not hitting it! See, why can't things not hit me in the head like that? Oh, I'm trying to remember. I don't know, I'll pay attention to how much money I do get out of it, but yeah. You get a good amount of money per coconut. I want to say 200 or something like that. Some thousand number. Because 150 LBs, that's quite a bit. I mean, you're going to have to probably replay this in order to get on to at least the next mission. More than likely. So, what... Stop. Hold on, stop. Because, like, I'm con... I think I hit all the trees, almost. Oh, shit. Grab it, grab it, grab it. We can so do this. Go, 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 go. I, this is the worst commentary ever. I'm just gonna hyperventilate. I was in a rush. Shut up. It's easy, I know, right? There you go. Okay, so let's pay attention. <clears throat> I'm gonna get ranked on it too, so. Tw uh, 2400? Oh, I got a gold, that's pretty good. 2400, so divide that by 12, and that's how much you get. So I wanna say like 2000 of coconut. That's not too bad. I mean, it's as good as it's gonna get for now. Uh, something a little shady, perhaps. <sighs> I remember coming here for it. Okay, yeah, I don't really care. 
So what he does is because of this, we're now allowed to do assassination missions, which is the shadier thing. You can get some of these, they're all pretty repetitive, but I don't know. Like, I guess I can show them off, but I mean, like, after a while, it, it, it is, like, it's the same thing. You're killing people. That's literally the extent of it. So, I can show off these two, Pizza Butt and Smoke Hall. Remember that? One of these you'll get here at Can Entertainment. I want to say it's about halfway through the game. It's like the best paying job in the history of forever. Holy shit, once I get that, I'm going to like, you know, spread my ass cheeks and just point it at the ceiling and let shit fly everywhere. Except I wouldn't really do that because it would get in my hair and that's kind of, that's a no-go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then you find the place and thankfully my bike is right here. <clears throat> I think this is Pizza Butt I picked. Yeah, I want to say it's Pizza Butt. Whoa. And the... Okay. And the assassination missions you also get ranked on. Usually, it's like the same little generalized area on where you're supposed to be assassinating people. But, I mean... Yeah. I don't know. You don't really get anything except for money off of this stuff. So, yeah. If you're expecting more, don't. There is ways where you can, like, upgrade stuff and all that later, like, you can get, you know, what? Oh, there's a car in front of me. I'm looking at the compass. So don't judge me. Like, you can get better katanas, you can get better fighting moves, and shit like that, so. Later, there will be, like, the whole, I guess, I don't know, people call it RPG style. It fucking annoys me. Like, it's just good gameplay design to me. You can get upgraded stuff. Okay, mission start. Okay, now the goal here is to get rid of him as quick as possible. The rest of the guys are only existing to get in the way. So, let's at least try and get rid of some. But, like, he right there, you know, he says target, so that should indicate that he's the target. Okay, get rid of him. Come on! No, don't you dare! You fucker! Would you dare? Come on, we can get rid of him, 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 if you would just move! Jesus. That was so much more irritating than it needed to be, but once you get rid of him, there you go. It's done. I'm not very, I'm not the best at some of these assassination missions, so I'm not expecting to get much. That's what, 30,000? Okay, that's actually better than what we had, so yeah. Pizza Butt's not too bad. I think you actually get paid depending on how fast... No, I don't think it is how fast. I think it's a fixed pay. So, like, you got that. Hold on, I have enough money? Oh, well, shit. I don't care. I'm still showing off that other assassination mission anyway. Uh, if I could get on my own bike! Do you have any idea how irritating this is? Finally, mother fuck. Okay, where's K Entertainment? You drive awfully. What is that place? What's this jogging man? Okay, for some reason this seems like it's controlling horrible. Firstly, I want to see what this is. And while I'm at it, I guess I can like. There's an ATM. Oh, this is the job center. Okay, well, I don't want to go here. Um, there's an ATM near the hotel, so if you want, that's where it is. It's literally just down the street. So, yeah, I'm going to at least pay everything up, and then we'll clear up the next assassination mission, and then I'll, or I mean, the next hit, I guess you could call it. Ranked fight, there you go, that's a proper term. And then I'll call it... Eh, I may do a little bit of off-screen grinding or something. And then we'll call it deuces for tonight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Shouldn't be in my fucking way, you know that? Now, there's one little side mission later in the game that's actually pretty helpful. And, I guess, advised. But I went through the game without doing it. So, I mean, like, I have no issue, you know, ignoring it again. But, I mean, like, if I can put together like a guide for it, I will consider doing it. But yeah, there's like this optional thing that's like a collect-a-thon. There's little things around the city that you can like pick up. 
And if you collect them all and return them, you know, to the guy who wants the pieces for some fucking reason, you can get a special move kind of shit. And it's helpful, but I mean, I don't really care that much. So, yeah. Also, when it comes to the rest of these assassination missions, I'm just going to go ahead and cut out. I'll just meet you by it because it's unnecessary driving around. I'm just going to let these first parts be kill until you die. Mission ends when your life runs out. Okay, I can deal with that. But afterwards, you know, like this driving around stuff's kind of repetitive and annoying, so yeah, who really needs it? Alright, now as you notice during the whole pizza butt mission, these guys are stronger, so there's no guarantee I'm going to kill a bunch of these guys, but I like how the map moved, like, as the camera switched. So yeah, I don't really know how well I'll do, but... There we go. Yeah. Well, hold on, there's a time limit. I thought I was kill until you die. What happens if I live through it? I mean, you're probably going to doubt that I will, but... Out of curiosity's sake... Can I get something that's not an up? I really prefer the side swing best. Yeah, that's great. See, like, if it was a right or left swing, and it's random, by the way, see, like this? You can hit so many more people. Okay. But see, if it's up, you can only hit them or the guy that's literally physically touching his anus. Which makes it annoying. Okay, I gotta cycle back and forth between high and low. And then anytime I do get a side swing, there's no one around. I don't know, like, if I don't show anything, it'll probably be the assassination missions, just because they're all so repetitive. Like, that's really it. I'm gonna show the jobs because the jobs are all actually different. The assassination missions are basically the same. Oh, wow, so I didn't die. <laughs> the assassination missions are all really repetitive, so I mean, I guess I could just, like, you know, get rid of those if you want. I mean, I'm probably gonna just do it anyway, because, you yeah. know. Well, shit, let's go ahead and just progress on with the story, because I've shown off all the litter, uh, the money-earning stuff for now. Yeah. So, let's try and find the... Well, I wonder what that M is. Actually, I think, like, if you see a random M on the map, kind of like that one up there at the top, I believe that's just, like, you could randomly get into, like, a fight. It'll be like an assassination mission, almost, but not quite. I don't really know how to explain it, but... Yeah. I mean, I wouldn't know how to explain it to someone who hasn't played it, really. All I know is you just get in, like, fights, and then, like, if you take, like, a single hit, you lose, and it's over, it's done. Alright, there's the money symbol, so that's where we need to go. Um, cross the street a little bit further, please. Like, now, see, that was not nearly enough of momentum to knock down a tree or a lamppost. Uh, you see how fat those dollars are? Imagine that. You've paid the entrance fee. Okay, so yeah. It's not too bad, then. I mean, you do get paid after each ranked fight, so I mean, that kind of helps. I would really appreciate moving. And then I believe after this, you want to go right back to your home, which the entrance is over here, okay? Making sure. It's been a while. Like, literally, I've only actually completed this game once. I haven't played it much since. I did, like, a little practice run, but I didn't go this far in, like, right when it came time. It's like, do your job. So I was like, dude, fuck this. I'm done. So... I played a little bit just to make sure I knew how to fight properly, but that's about it.